Also joining us in Atlanta, Randy Kessler, defense attorney. I want to go out to Randy Kessler. Randy, we hear that the FBI and other law enforcement involved in this are interviewing and now re-interviewing some of the relatives and other people uh, close to this case. Is that uncommon? No, they need to interview and interview and interview until they get to the bottom, bottom line. You know, there's no reason they should stop until they see everything, everywhere, everyone. I mean, and everybody should be documenting what's said. I'm glad the police are being tight-lipped so that when a witness does make a statement, it's not because they heard it on our show or they heard it somewhere else. It's got to be independent and it's got to be original. And so they need to ask all the questions, and then they can piece it together and see what makes sense and what doesn't make sense. Absolutely. No, I think, I think they're doing a great job. Okay, we found some items of interest. We're not going to tell you because once you get a suspect, a possible suspect, you bring them in, you start interviewing them, and they're only going to know certain things if they, ha if they were actually involved in that 